Are you constantly battling the discomfort of phlegm and mucus in your throat, or you're going about your day feeling great, when suddenly you get that annoying tickle or the sensation like something stuck in your throat? You cough, you clear your throat, but that pesky mucus just won't budge. In today's video, we're going to explore three common causes of this pesky problem. But before we begin, it's essential to understand that phlegm and mucus are natural bodily defenses that help protect our respiratory system. However, when they become excessive or persistent, it can indicate an underlying issue. So without further ado, let's jump right in. Cause 1. Allergies First things first, let's understand the role of our trusty nasal passages. Our nasal passages act as a filter, protecting our lungs from harmful particles in the air. But when allergies strike, everything goes haywire. As our immune system detects an allergen, it releases a substance called histamine to defend our body. Histamine triggers a series of reactions, leading to those annoying symptoms we all know too well. One of the main effects of histamine is the dilation of blood vessels in our nasal passages. This increase in blood flow results in swelling and congestion, making it harder for air to pass through. Now let's talk about the real culprits behind that unwanted phlegm and mucus. When our immune system is in allergy mode, it sends out signals to produce excess mucus as a way to trap and flush out those pesky allergens. The excess mucus finds its way into our throat, causing that constant urge to clear it. It's your body's way of eliminating the allergens, but trust me, it can be quite the nuisance. Cause 2. Sinusitis Sinusitis is a common condition where the sinuses, the hollow spaces within the bones of our face, become inflamed and swollen. This inflammation can lead to an overproduction of mucus, resulting in that constant phlegm sensation. When the sinuses become inflamed, the lining of the sinuses produces excess mucus as a defense mechanism. This mucus helps to trap and eliminate harmful particles, such as bacteria, viruses, allergens, or irritants that enter our nasal passages. Think of it as the body's way of keeping our respiratory system clean and protected. But here's the catch. When the sinuses are inflamed, the excess mucus cannot drain properly due to blockages caused by the inflammation. As a result, the mucus starts to accumulate, causing that persistent phlegm and mucus sensation in your throat. So how can we effectively manage sinusitis and reduce this bothersome phlegm and mucus? Treatment options for sinusitis often depend on the underlying cause. It can range from over-the-counter decongestants to prescription medications. Additionally, nasal irrigation, steam inhalation, and keeping the nasal passages moist can help ease the symptoms and promote mucus drainage. Cause 3. Acid reflux Acid reflux occurs when the stomach acid flows back into the esophagus, causing irritation. But you might wonder, what does that have to do with the mucus and phlegm in your throat? Well, when acid reflux episodes happen frequently, they can inflame the esophagus. To protect itself from this irritation, the esophagus produces extra mucus as a defense mechanism. This mucus aims to create a barrier between the corrosive stomach acid and the delicate lining of the throat. Now, here's where things get interesting. The excess mucus doesn't just stay in the esophagus. It begins to creep its way up into your throat, creating that uncomfortable sensation of constant phlegm. So, the more severe your acid reflux is, the more mucus your throat has to produce to combat it. But what causes acid reflux, you ask? Several factors can contribute to it. One of the primary culprits is a weakened lower esophageal sphincter, a muscle that acts as a door between the esophagus and the stomach. When this sphincter doesn't close properly, stomach acid can flow back up, triggering acid reflux episodes. Certain lifestyle choices and diet can also exacerbate acid reflux. Spicy foods, caffeinated beverages, and even stress can all play a role. So if you often find yourself dealing with constant phlegm in your throat, taking control of your acid reflux might be the key to finding relief. There are steps you can take to minimize the impact of acid reflux and reduce that constant phlegm in your throat. Avoiding trigger foods, eating smaller, more frequent meals, and staying hydrated can make a significant difference. And here are a few reasons that causing you mucus in your throat. Now, if you've tried all these tips and your phlegm and mucus persist, it's important to seek medical advice. A healthcare professional can help identify any underlying conditions that may require treatment. If you found this video helpful, be sure to give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button to get notified of more informative content. Thanks for watching and see you next time.